Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Andrea if you're new here. Today I have part two to my collective summer haul. So I'm gonna stop talking and we're gonna get started with our try and haul. So the first store that I'm gonna start off with is I Saw It First. I got this sheer black top from I Saw It First. It has a tie bit at the top and a tie bit at the bottom. And I think it's so cute. It's all poofy and ballooned. I think this would look cute with a black tank or black bralette with jeans or a skirt or shorts. It can be like a cute day outfit with some slides. Or you can dress it up with some mules or some strappy heels. I really wanted a white satin dress and I was searching all over. None of the dresses really, you know, was what I was feeling. And then I came across this babe on Instagram called Yasmin. I think her name is Yasmin Chanel. And I saw this white satin dress on her. She got it from Motel Rocks. She had a 25% discount code. And I was like, sis, sis is really wanting me to buy this dress. So you know what I did? I went and bought the dress. It's this white mini satin dress. dress came with a belt as well and I didn't like it with the belt so I just took it out and this dress is so cute without it. The straps are adjustable, it's really good quality and I think I paid 30 something for it, no, I paid 20 something, I'll leave the prices of everything on the screen but I believe I paid 20 six for it. That dress with some slides, get cute white heels, a white bag, a look. That's what it is, a look. So the next place I went to was Zara. I cannot do a haul without including an item from Zara. I love Zara. And their new spring summer line. I got this scarf print high neck top. The only irritating thing about this top is the head hole. Look how small it is. I feel like you need to do your makeup after you put on this top. This is such a cute top. This was only... 13 pounds. The next place that I went to was Opoly. Opoly and Zara, I just, you know. I can't do a haul without these two stores. I got this milkmaid style corset top from Opoly. I purchased this in a size 12. Honestly, I'm going to be wearing this top to every motive during summer. This top is cute. Like, it is so cute. This top and that white satin dress, I'm going to be alternating between the two because I can't get enough of these two items. So the next store that I went to was Misguided. I got one item from Misguided as well, which was this military pleated skirt. I plan to pair this skirt with a ruffle cream top that I got from Pretty Little Thing, which I will show you later on. So now I'm moving on to Pretty Little Thing. I've got this huge bag. So first things first, I got my airport outfit. It's just this gray jumpsuit. It has buttons all the way down and the waist is cinched in. The legs are a bit long for me, which I expected anyway. I plan to style it with some leg gold chains and some thick socks and some white trainers. So the next item I got from Pretty Little Thing was this sheer ruffled top, which I plan to pair with that military skirt from Misguided. The next thing I got from Pretty Little Thing was this crochet cover up. These flares were a bit too long for me. I did have to get two inches removed off the bottom. To go with that cover up, I got this white bikini set. This bikini was sold separately. I had just done a mix and match between these two because I didn't like the bottoms that the model was wearing with the bikini top and I didn't like the top that the model was wearing with the other bikini bottoms that I got. You tie it around your neck and then, and these straps tie around your back. I'll insert a picture of the model on the side somewhere. I got the top in um, a couple sizes up because I wanted to make sure everything was covered, you know. I got the top in a size 16 and the ones that I got to match with these were these white bandage high leg bottoms. These I got in a size 12. So I got some tops from Pretty Little Thing and yes, 
they are white I have a problem with purchasing white items I got this white cropped cow neck top I didn't know the straps weren't going to be adjustable so when I do wear it I might have to stitch it a little or do like a little knot on the straps because these straps are like, look how long they are why is the strap this long? The next top that I got was a white satin rouge tie detail cami. This is kind of similar to a milkmaid top, but it's just this crop top and it flares out at the bottom. The last thing that I got from Pretty Thing was this midi dress. On the website, it didn't look like tiger stripes. It looked more like a marbly brown type of pattern. But in person, it actually looks like tiger stripes. I don't mind, but you know, I wish I was informed. So that's all from the clothing items that I got in this haul. Now moving on to the summer shoes that I got. First thing I got was from Simi, and it's just this wedge neon orange sandal and they're super comfortable because of the wedge so i can actually go through a whole like a whole night wearing these shoes and i'll be calm with them so now moving on to sandals i got these heeled sandals from zara the height of the heel is comfortable the only thing i would say they're not wide foot friendly so if you have a wide feet like moi your pinky's gonna hurt period like your pinky toe is going to hurt the next sandals that i got are from new look they're dupe of the zara sandals and they're a fraction of the price just these are brown sandals and the only difference is the white stitching that comes across but everything else is basically the same and the sandals from zara are 20 pounds these were only eight pounds they were doing like a 10 percent discount so like i got these for seven pounds zara ones are 20 pounds the other shoes that i got from simi with these sandals. It just has a clear bit for your toe and this goes around your foot. These sandals are a bit impractical because the sole is plastic. When it does get hot and sweaty, your foot kind of slips and slides. The shoe is cute. I'm just still gonna wear it. And if it falls off my foot again in public, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below if you like my try and hauls and I'll be sure to do more. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. <laughs>